Hi everyone. Google has a floating keyboard option in its board keyboard app for Android. Here's a complete guide on how to use the floating Google keyboard on Android. The floating keyboard is simply not a separate app. The board app itself floats on top of any app, making touchscreen typing more comfortable. It also allows users to resize the keyboard and move the entire keyboard across the screen. But for it to work, you have to set board as your default keyboard on your Android phone. The alternative methods to use the floating keyboard other than board are Microsoft-owned SwiftKey, Samsung Keyboard, etc. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to enable or disable the floating keyboard on Android. Before you proceed to further steps make sure you have the latest version of the board. Now to activate the floating board keyboard open any application where you can type. Then click on the three dots icon on the right. Now you just need to tap on the floating option. That's all as you can see my keyboard is now floating. You can use the four-way arrow icon to drag and move the keyboard wherever you want when you tap on the four-way arrow icon. The corners will be highlighted you can drag these corners to resize the keyboard. Once you enable the floating feature every time you use the keyboard, it will be floating. If you want to disable the floating keyboard, just tap and hold the four-way arrow icon and drag the keyboard to the bottom of the screen. If you are using the floating keyboard quite often, you can add the floating option on the top of the keyboard for direct access. To do that, tap and hold the floating option and drag it to the suggestion strip.